Zagaravia, the fallen city, the land of no return, where darkness won and we demon hunters lost. One year ago, a plea for help summoned hunters to Zagaravia. Many answered the call. No one returned. I thought Adrian dead, until a raven delivered his message. He too summoned me to Zagaravia. He saw what I seek. Adrian is a friend. One of the precious few I have. And the only man who knows of my past. Of the pact I made, and the demon powers I wield. Whatever haunts this cursed city, I will face to find my friend. The city is eerily quiet, not a human soul in sight. Monsters have claimed the streets. Dim lights shine through the dusty windows. I wonder what horrors hide behind them. I sense something hidden, something far more sinister than the monsters, something faint, like a whisper in the back of my mind. Hello? Who goes there? Hello? Can you hear me? A voice in my head? What else? If you can hear me, jump now. Come on, jump, 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 jump. Good boy. Now roll over. <laughs> Just kidding.
I know this place. You're getting closer. Come on, open that door. Oh, watch out, Hunter. Those dummies look tough. They outnumber you. You should consider retreating. <laughs> Those dummies with their red eyes and long noses. They're laughing at your feeble attacks. <laughs> Wait, are you still fighting the dummies? Come on, put your back into it, hit harder. Maybe I should stop wasting my time on you, Hunter, and make friends with the dummies instead. Demon power. Where did you learn to do that? Hmm. Anyway, I'm trapped in that box. Come on, break it. Wait, that's not me. Oh well, I must be in another dungeon. <laughs> I sense something shiny in your eye. Let me give you a hint. It's bigger than a spider, but it is also full of treasure. And it is sitting on the top looking down at you. Thank you. 
Seriously, you give up on the treasure? There's something about that voice. Something I can't quite place. I've fought and slain many monsters in my line of work. The ones that talk are always the worst. There are survivors after all this time. Castle Zagora still stands, a refuge from the horrors outside. I'm Damien the Alchemist. I can help you with useful supplies, like potions and bombs. And you can help me with your gold. <laughs> We alchemists are said to transmute gold into air, but it's all for the benefits of science. Take a look through my inventory. There's not much demand from hunters these days. Another hunter comes to save the day. Maybe we stand a chance against the countless hordes now. Or maybe you'll just die like all the others. My name is Victor Vran, and I didn't expect this kind of warm welcome in Zagaravia. I'm looking for a friend. I won't stay a minute longer after I find him. Listen, Vran. I don't care. Just one rule. Don't promise the impossible to Her Majesty. Every day I endeavor to convince her to give up hope of saving this city. And with you around, she will become even more determined to stay and die in this cursed castle. If this happens, I will hold you personally responsible. You hear me? Heavens, God has answered our prayers in this hour of need and sent you here. I am Casimir, servant of his will and patriarch of Zagaravia. You bring hope to my people, and hope is what we need in these dark hours. My prayers will be with you. Welcome to Zagoravia, Hunter. 
Thank you for answering our summons and bringing your sword to our cause. Soon we will push back the enemy. If you hurry, you will be rewarded. Your Majesty, I would gladly see you to safety. It is not safety that we want. We are going to win this war, and free my kingdom from the demons. No further help is coming, Your Majesty. What brought me here is the fate of a fellow hunter by the name of Adrian. You may believe no help is coming, and have given up, but we stand strong. But if it is your friend you seek, you must go south, to the Royal Gardens. Thank you, Your Majesty. The Queen is strong-willed. It must be how she got this far, but it changes nothing. The city is overrun.